tough housing market. The stress of selling a home is tough enough, but an Omaha grandmother now has something to compound that tension. As Jim Sidelecki shows us, her home is on the market, and that might have been all thieves needed to create their own open house. Here's this week's burglaries and break-ins. Rini Scott has owned this home near 31st in Paxton for quite a while. I bought this house when I retired in 90. And over those two decades, she's never had a problem until last week. They broke the lock off of this door. With her house on the market, it sits empty, but thieves still found plenty to take. They took the microwave off the wall. See, they took the water heater from back there. This is from the furnace, the air conditioner. They tried to get the tub out. And I guess it was too difficult for them. It's a tough situation. You have a very well-maintained neighborhood, a brand new elementary school, and you want people to know the home is for sale. But how do you do that without letting thieves know that nobody's home? I don't know if they cased the house, you know, or what. But uh, we are keeping a closer eye on this one now. That goes for Rini's neighbor, too. They were hit on the same day. They got the bathtub and the... Had a water heater from over there. Both crimes likely happened during daylight hours and just a block away from OPD's Northeast Precinct. What does a crook care? <laughs> the damage will cost around $5,000 to fix, but Rini finds some comfort in the fact that they did leave one thing in the house. Well, I'm glad that it is. That's a new sink. In Omaha, I'm Jim Sidelecki, Channel 6 News. Well,